the clumsy 3v3 multiplayer shooter Umbrella Corps might be set in the Resident Evil universe, but it doesn't carry the name. Maybe because it's such a misstep that Capcom didn't want to damage the beloved horror brand. Its mechanics contradict each other, balance is absurd, controls are clumsy, and it does almost nothing with Resident Evil's lore. Umbrella Corps simply feels lost. To start, it's a cover-based shooter with cover that doesn't matter. Multiplayer maps are packed with zombies, and any human tucked into a corner is easy prey. You're much better off lowering your profile by just moving around crouched, because there's only a tiny speed penalty. Even prone characters move absurdly fast. Firefights take too long to finish thanks to clunky movements, weak guns, and bullet-spongy characters. Plus, first-person aiming hits your already shambling character with a speed penalty, so chasing someone down to accurately land a finishing shot feels like a chore. As one of the decorative in-game patches says, 100 shots, one kill. One thing Umbrella Corps gets right is the pace of unlocks. If the game were better, the guns and gear would be a strong incentive to keep playing. But the loot system is mostly irrelevant thanks to the overpowered Brainer. It lets you move quickly, deflect attacks, and it has a one-hit kill with a huge range. It's way too easy to run at someone, eat their bullets, and still get the kill. Why be excited for new gear when you already have the best weapon? Resident Evil's influence is mostly seen in the maps. The iconic levels are detailed, but they're too cramped with dozens of zombies around. Dying soon after a respawn is frustrating, and sometimes those cheap deaths cost you the game. There's one fun mode where you collect DNA vials from dead zombies, but it's the only mode that uses zombies well. The other standard modes aren't necessarily bad, just uninspired. Even Umbrella Corps single player mode, the experiment, is too shallow to hold your attention for long. There are so many health pickups that it ruins the tension of trying to complete all the missions with just one life. What we're left with is an awful shooter that doesn't leverage its few strengths. Umbrella Corps feels like a game made for no one. For more on all things Resident Evil, stick with IGN.